Today we will be on a date with. Hi, I'm Charlie. I'm 22, and I'm a, I'm a climber. And my favourite pizza is pizza napolitana. In TDT Unimed first date, we get to know our new riders better through challenges. My fan base there are more honest to me. Iedere dag een koers en iedere dag ook weer een nieuwe kans. That could be unbelievable. In the first part, we'll test Charlie's knowledge about Tour de Titema. Does he know enough about his new team or does he make a bad first impression? I'll mix it up a little. Which current TDT Unibet rider is the only one to have participated in one of the Grand Tours? Kevin Inkler. Really good, yes. Did you, did you know which one? I'm gonna go uh, the Giro. No. Uh, Welter? Yeah. Wow. Uh, in which position did Josi finish in the TDT Ronde van Hank? Did he DNF? Yeah, really good. How did you know? I remember seeing it on Instagram actually. Uh, he crashed, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Two times. Two. Oh. Can you say to the camera like give give Josi a tip or something? Like give Josi a tip. Uh, keep away from Joran. <laughs> really good one. Okay, next. So, what is the most viewed video of Tour de Titema ever? Challenge, basketball challenge. No. Um, does the 150 pizzas count, count as a challenge or not? Yeah, it's, but but it isn't the one. Oh no! I'm really out. famous one. Really famous. Well, Joran's hobby. Joran's hobby. Yeah. I have no idea what Joran. Joran and Daffy Day's hobby. <laughs> you do it with your bike. Oh wheelie! Oh the wheelie challenge. Yeah, yeah. Can you do wheelie or? Uh, ish. We'll go with ish. Bike dependence. <laughs> All right, next one. What is the name of the very first official race ever for TDT Unibet? Stern van Zolder? Stern van Zolder? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Who became the highest uh, ranking uh, rider? Do you know? Um, in, Arte, in TDT Unibet? No, in that race? In that race? No idea. Big Couldn't guy. Big guy. Belgium or Dutch? Dutch. Uh, the per, uh, highest, high, uh, who's professional now? Yeah, yeah. Came in second. Came in second? Behind Koen van Meltfort. Absolutely no idea. Martijn. Martijn, oh, okay. You didn't see that on Instagram. No, I didn't see that <laughs> on Instagram. I wasn't paying too much attention. <laughs> Last year, there was one current TDT Unibet rider who participated in the World Champs. Who was that? In 2023, they participated in World Champs. Oh. Was it a road world champs or a gravel? Road. Oh, okay. Uh, was it Toma Kopecki? You're really close. Really close. Why are you close? Why am I close? What? He was Adam. <laughs> yes. Oh, I thought you. I thought you meant. I thought you meant old riders. All oh, no. oh, right. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Adam then. Yeah. Every day of the week. There's too many black bikes. So you chose the best team to uh, ride for, right? Exactly. It's good to be good to get some colour in. France every every time. Why? So I know how to order at the cafe. <laughs> it's just about that. Yeah. Cli climbing is like also your specialty, right? Yeah, climbing for sure, for sure. Uh, yeah, and there's something about the style of the French Alps as well. Can I just nod? Is like no, that. no, 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 you uh, have to pick. Adam or Simon? Yeah, right, right, for sure. Why for sure? It's... In fact, I'm not really sure, actually. Uh, it was a choice of a flip of a coin. <laughs> okay, but you said for sure, but you didn't mean no, it. No, <laughs> not at all. Uh, the Giro. Why? I like the, the chaoticness of the races and it's sort of, it's always open at the Giro and you see crazy attacks going on and I love the fact that every single parkour at the Giro, it's always super hard. Uh, yeah, I, li I like to cook in the kitchen. I just think, think myself as a bit of a master chef, uh, but yeah, it's a good, good way to pass the time. What's your best recipe? Best recipe? Oh. I could crack out a banging curry. <laughs> do, do, do your teammates already know? Or? Yeah, a few, a few of them do know that I can cook a little. A few of the French guys. We might even make uh, like a video of you cooking some uh, curry. Uh, oh yeah, well, I'll be for down for that. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, curry for the guys. <laughs> can we make a promise now? That yeah, you we will? can make a promise. I'll do a cooking video. 
Okay, okay. <laughs> Leave a comment below if you want me to see me do a cooking video. We'll cook up so a, nasty, a nice curry. <laughs> right. Uh, Valdeo, sir. Uh, I think I've never done having told you having year, but um, I think the five stages that they always put in, they're always as hard as possible. Crazy climbs and crazy descents. Was also a special race for you uh, this year, right? Yeah, it was a special race this year. It was uh, I uh, I came fourth on GC there, and the other guys who were in front of me all, all sort of uh, super strong uh, climbers. And I think that was sort of a moment during the season when I really thought, okay, it might be possible to, to step up to the next level. And lo and behold, I had a, I had a message from a, from a certain uh, Bass Tietema the evening of the e evening of the Queen stage. It went rolling from that point? Uh, yeah, yeah, it, it was that. It was uh, straight after the race, I uh, sort of spoke with Bass. And then I think it was three days later in an Italian Airbnb, I was on a, a video call with Julia. <laughs> went fast. Yeah, it went quite. It, it sounds like you didn't have to think about it like a lot. Yeah, there was a bit of thought, but I think also is the, the project of the team, it really interested me. And uh, the ambition, the goal, and the, the personality of the team is, is what really, really drew me in. Polka dot jersey. I'd like to see a, a polka dot bike, for sure. Would it fit you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, think, I think I'd be well suited in polka dot. Would it be a loss, like uh, the beautiful TDT bike and then you get a polka dot bike? It's... I think TDT would do a pretty classy job of a polka dot bike. Thanks to everybody for tuning into the video. Uh, if can you leave a like, subscribe and make sure to leave a comment down below if you want to see some Charlie Page cooking videos.